I'm here with Miss Bobby Jean Olson and Ezra Estes, the director of the Fashion Design Program at the Santa Fe Community College. Ezra, what is your inspiration for your designs and how did you decide to get involved with Santa Fe Fashion Week? <laughs> Um, my inspiration comes from lots of different places. I take them frequently from nature. Um, you'll see that in some of my clothing, seashells and waves and such. Um, I have also been an avid horseman for many, many years, and so much of my uh, designs come from the uh, equestrian theme. You have several of your students on the runway. That is correct. Destiny Durand is a featured designer, and put up 20 looks, I think. Which yes, is, she did. And that was all done in a matter of about 60 days. So she has been working night and day to get that turned out. So good for uh, Destiny. Yes, she did a spectacular did job as I think well. So too. Congratulations. Um, so you also have your own specialty store in downtown Old Santa Fe? Is that correct? I do. Um, it seems unusual and it has been there since 1999, I think. So that's been a while. Good year. <laughs> <laughs> Popping the cork. <laughs> and so, yes, I've been a block west of the plaza on Palace Avenue um, for, looks like 14 or 15 years now. Kind now, of lose track after a while. When, when you say specialty store, what do you specialize in? Um, mostly one of the kinds. Um, so I do custom suitings, um, things like this, custom shirts. Uh, but then the fashion designs really are the preeminent uh, modus operandi for the studio now. Starting as a tailor, I kind of slowly migrated into women's wear. And of course, women's wear is a little more interesting than the boys. <laughs> yeah. They get to wear I colors so. other than tan, black, gray, and what else do they have? Navy. Ooh, exciting. <laughs> Navy. <laughs> love it. Love it. What can we look forward to on the runway this evening from Ezra? Um, the boys' wear will actually be mostly uh, non-traditional, so we're going to do a lot of sports wear. Um, there is a uh, 1960s-inspired uh, short tr swim trunk and a gorgeous male model wearing it, so that'll be fun. I did a little spin-off of um, the Trayvon Martin case and did a mm, nice. beach pant, if you will, with drawstrings and patch pockets done in men's pinstripe suitings as a comment nice. on... Are you a good guy or a bad guy? <laughs> My guess is as good as yours, right? And your guess is as good as mine? Absolutely. And so that's part of it. When we get into the ladies, um, obviously there's going to be a lot more color than the boys. Um, and I have done a series of, what would you say, uh, armor for women. Ooh. So dresses that are padded and very tailored. And mm. I think in a day and age where we've had crazy economic circumstances and waves of uh, boiling water, you know, that women want to feel protected and secure in their clothing. And so you're going to see quite a lot of that in my clothing this time. 